how to fix chronic pain. What can be the reasons for high prolactin levels? Okay. Why does stress affect gain so much? Sorry, this is actually more than one question. Thanks for your answers. I'll answer everything. Don't worry. How to fix chronic pain? What can, okay. Chron, okay. So chronic pain is when you just have pain basically for life. It like never goes away. A lot of chronic pain is because of muscular imbalances. Okay. So for me, my right, this muscle right here. So th that muscle right there is known as the vestus medialis. Okay, it is part of your quads. It's on the medial side of your body. So medialis. Now, I thought I had chronic pain in that muscle. When I was at strength camp, I was doing squats. None of the personal trainers figured this out. These are top, top guys and they didn't figure it out. What was happening is that I had chronic pain because there was a muscular imbalance in my body. So what is that? The anterior side of my body, right? So my abs, my quads, my shins, my biceps, these were all strong. But the back part of my body, the posterior chain, my glutes, my hamstrings, my lower back, my calves, super weak. So because I wasn't using my glutes during squats and lunges and other exercises, I had chronic pain in my vessels medialis. So you have to fix your muscular imbalance. Now, what is that for you? I don't know. I would have to know where your chronic pain is, what is actually happening. And here's another thing that I forgot to cover. If you get the 90-day group coaching, I will personally look at your blood test results and I will tell you exactly what's going on because the actual physician fat guy who is doing your blood test, you know, looking at your results, he doesn't know what the testosterone is for your age. He has no idea, he or she. And he probably has low testosterone and will prescribe injections for you if you have low T or some bullshit androgel or some other money-making scheme. I will personally look at your blood test results guaranteed. Okay, so that's something I'm throwing in right now. Purchase today, you get that. Uh, high prolactin levels, milk. Milk, dairy, very high estrogen foods will increase prolactin levels. Now, what will that do? That will lower testosterone. Prolactin levels actually increase in fathers. So when you become a father, prolactin increases, testosterone goes down. That's why when you become a father, you're not that turned on anymore. You, your testosterone goes a little bit lower because of prolactin levels going up. So milk and dairy is the major issue with prolactin or you becoming a dad. Why does stress affect gain so much? Okay, so cortisol is a catabolic hormone. Okay, there's anabolic and catabolic, anabolism, catabolism. Anabolism is when you are making gains, right? So insulin, adrenaline, testosterone, human growth hormone. These are anabolic hormones. They give you gains. They give you bigger muscles. Cortisol is a catabolic hormone. It actually allows you to wake up in the morning. Okay, so it kills your weight your body weight it kills fat too but it can also kill muscle and it can also lower the rate of the increase in muscle gains so that's why uh cortisol does that uh yeah 